Reaching Kansas City, today's ruling has a very personal impact on local same-sex couples. Garrett Haig talked with one of them, and he picks up our team coverage from Lee Summit. A typical day in Judy Bishop's house ends with her cooking dinner for her wife, Peggy. They're kind of like brats, but they're really not. But tonight, the dinner conversation was about a court decision, anything but typical. I honestly, I never thought that Kansas... And Missouri would do anything like this. I thought we'd be the very last ones. Judy and Peggy met decades ago at the hospital where both were working. I was standing by the elevator, and the elevator door opens, and she was standing there. After 20 years together, the couple decided it was finally time to get married, and last October drove six hours north to Iowa, where they had a Halloween themed wedding. It was so much fun. Just so much fun. Uh, and it's so unusual. Over two decades together, they've seen relationships like theirs become less unusual in the eyes of their friends and neighbors. They believe today's ruling means soon the state will see their marriage just like any other. How important would it be to have your marriage recognized by Missouri, too? Oh, it'd be excellent. It would just be like, oh my gosh, they finally. They finally know us. They finally recognize us. And with that recognition, they hope to find acceptance of a marriage they see as typical in today's Missouri. When people love each other, what difference does it make? In Lee's Summit, Garrett Hake, 41 Action News.